Hi, my name's Dave, I work at Liberty and I'm here out in the cold to tell you something extremely important about Brexit that you might have missed. Whether you voted leave or remain, you definitely didn't vote for fewer rights. I mean, it was pretty strict with how the question was phrased and I feel like someone would have noticed that. Either way, that's exactly what could happen if that lot in there don't do a serious refurb on this, the EU withdrawal bill. This is the document laying down how we're going to leave Europe and what EU laws are coming with us when we do. And I'm talking about laws that affect all of us. Laws protecting workers, LGBT people, older people, anyone with a disability. Rights and freedoms our ancestors fought and died for. But right now this bill is a serious threat to their legacy and your rights. It gives the small number of ministers rewriting our laws the powers to play around with them without even consulting Parliament. And when you cut out Parliament, you cut out the people. And they call these powers Henry the Eighth clauses. Because what? He's remembered for rational decision making. See, there's nothing in this bill stopping them from weakening our rights in the rewrite process. They say trust us. But I'd really rather just have it in black and white, if that's alright. Especially as the government says it's a simple copy and paste job of all our existing law. But they've already singled out the EU Charter of Fundamental Rights as the one law that don't make the cut. So nah, trust us ain't good enough. And that's exactly why Liberty is demanding a People's Clause in the text of the bill, guaranteeing we'll bring home all the rights we had when we was in the EU. It's that simple. And politicians from every party are already getting behind it. Call on yours to do the same today. You'd be surprised, they do actually want to hear from you. Trust us ain't enough. Protect you and yours now for the future and back the People's Clause.